Hello, Jim Ritter here, J Ritter 660 on YouTube, James A Ritter on Facebook. Wow, this has been a day, hasn't it? Hope you enjoyed the ride with me in the Easy Go golf cart. We plan on getting a new windshield for that, but it probably won't be till after we have our first sale. And I have the feeling the first sale is going straight into the <coughs> savings. I'm going to talk to an accountant and have him help me set up the account, to keep back my taxes and send them in every three months. So I won't owe. They'll pay me back even more. <coughs> sort of an automatic pay payback instead of paying in. Um. Trying to think of what I was going to tell, cause the, we, I was starting to think of a discussion. Oh, yeah. Remember when I left off a couple days ago? Maybe you don't. About cars. Um. Yeah. Uh. Gonna. When you. When I get my new my car magazines, I notice that all the cars all across the board are the point systems are just a little over a hundred, but the variance isn't more than about ten percent. Well, you think about it, a student in school who gets ninety percent that's an A. So most cars out there on the road today are A's. So what it's, if it's an A+. Plus. They're still pretty dependable. Most of them have three, four, five years of warranty on them. So at least for the first three, four, five years, if there's anything wrong with them, the company will take care of it. You know, unless they can prove abuse, which if you've been abusing it, they can prove it. <laughs> If you haven't and something happens and, and they think it's abuse, then I don't know what. But anyway, in general, I think most people are probably definitely better than 51% of people are satisfied with their car. For many years past the warranty even. And really, when it comes to what I said before, um, the nut behind the wheel is the most important part of the vehicle. You get your services done when you're supposed to get them done. You get your oil changes done when you're supposed to get them done. Um, you have a whole manual that tells you everything that you need to do to get done on your vehicle and at what point in time. They even have computers inside your engine that can t test the viscosity and the amount of dirt inside your oil so you may have to come in less than 3,000 but very often it is closer to 10,000 miles before you have to get an oil change of course as the car gets older that may change and uh, but anyway not to get into deep technicalities um, really when I I can only afford used vehicles when I get my vehicle it really comes to what they call the luck of the draw what I get handed is what I get handed <coughs> how you doing but on the other hand I have to go by my my percentages and my percentages in the vehicles that I purchased, like I've told you, Ford, um, Chrysler products, mainly Dodges, and then Chevrolets, and that includes things like Oldsmobiles and things like that. Um, I have drove. I've driven one Chevrolet that was far and beyond above any other vehicle I've ever owned. So, see, that even breaks the, the code there. So, just a little something for you to think about. So, 
go ahead and subscribe down below leave a thumbs up i hope my face you can see my face can you see my face <laughs> trying to get in the sunshine but it's going away so i'm gonna try to get in the living room but my wife has been on the phone a lot tonight and so she's been having family issues her brother's in the hospital or something like that anyway have a great and wonderful day. I'm having a great and wonderful day. And we will see you tomorrow. TTFN. Bye-bye.